you all please rise and join me in the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, we have a full house of board members. All seven of us are here. So I'd ask for first thing on the agenda would be public comment. Uh, we allot five minutes per person. We ask that you ID yourself. And the floor is yours if there's any public comment. Okay, hearing none, none we'll move along with committee reports. Do you uh, folks for Verizon have anything you wish to address this morning? I don't. Do you guys have anything for me? Any from you folks? We have an IDPH inspection today on all of our ambulances, but then that for the ambulance to attempt to get it in service today. So I'm not going to stick around unless you guys have anything for me that's occurring at noon today. Okay. This sounds like a lot more fun than watching them inspect ambulances, yes, it but it's your call. Depends the day. Yeah. Uh, question. Uh, Northern Navy County, I read where they uh, dropped down. What was it? Something that can only make certain runs now, not, like a heart attack. They can't make a run for a heart attack. Is that correct? They can still go on the calls, but their level of care okay. decreased based on state standards. They. Okay. Um, they were operating at the intermediate life support level, and the state no longer recognizes that as a level. Oh, so across the state. Across the state, not just Northern oh, okay. Acre County. Okay, we, would, we went over this last time. Yeah. Yeah. So what happens if, if they call in and say, hey, this person's having a heart attack, who makes a run now? You make a run or something? No, they'll, they'll still go, and if the person needs care above what they're able to give, then they can call for an intercept. Okay. All right. So in layman's terms, they went from being able to give about 20 different medications down to about five different medications. Okay. So that's one of the quite That was the biggest part of the piece of the puzzle is their medications they can give dropped way down. Well, they were talking about a run the other day. Somebody was and something about Northern Air County could not do what they're supposed to be doing or what they used to. What they used to be able right, to. Right. Mm -hmm. And that's just a state state that's mandate. State. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Illinois is finally getting in line with national standards, which they're 10 years beyond the eight ball on that, but... No. <laughs> Not possible. Anything yeah, else? Three A's or O's for the Prairie Press in case she's trying to quote you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Augie, do you have anything this morning? Uh, we're still early voting, and uh, we have... Oh, somewhere around 125, 30 early votes, which is, um, it's, it's average. Um, not great, uh, but it's not bad. So it's just steady. So, um, other than that, why the, uh, I don't want to steal Andy's thunder, but Sycamore seems to be progressing along pretty well. Uh, Looks like all of the, uh, uh, is it, how is that pronounced? Is it VRFs? Or uh, VRFs. Variable flow. VRF. Variable. Refrigerator flow. Variable, variable flow. flow. Yeah. yeah. Looks yeah. like yeah. all yeah. those yeah. units are installed. Uh, lights are installed. So, so you had a shutdown at the courthouse on Saturday. Right? That's coming up. <clears throat> oh, is that coming yeah, up? Yeah, that's coming up. It's a total shutdown uh, so they can make the transition over to the new. HVAC system, which they so they the actual scheduled this is total shutdown coming up, not a hey no. something blew up. No, no, total shutdown scheduled. And so it went out to all department heads. Everybody knows questions were Shut asked. The computers off and back them out. <laughs> the, uh, if you haven't been by, you might run by the courthouse. They they poured that slab of concrete and they set the exterior units on it. So, is that on the north? That's on the north. north. That's pretty neat look. Yeah. You saw it? Yeah. It it a, a you can't see it through the windows, can you, inside? Well, I, I don't know. Okay. I haven't looked through there. Um, in visiting with yeah. the sheriff about that, he, he was thinking about we maybe need to construct some kind of a, 
fence. I thought the same. Maybe thing. some razor wire around it just to. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe some yeah. landmines. Keep somebody from getting their fingers Clean in there because that's some pretty. I, I because that's where everything is thing. now. It it's, is. It's right in there. It would be a nice thing to vandalize it. Or vandalizing it. Right. It's like, it's like a pretty fine. Um, like on your air conditioner, if you ever look inside, it's all those fins that fin piping. So. Yeah, Shh. close them all up. So what's that sitting on the, uh, the northwest corner of the courthouse? That's it. That's, that's what we just said. That's it. Yeah. I was asleep. That's all it's I have. It's affecting your brain today, is it? <laughs> well, you got us talking, so yeah. it's, it's all good. Well, that segues right into you, Andy. Right. Everybody needs to go by and see that. And I, I look pretty, pretty neat. neat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Hopefully, um, that'll they should have that up and running in the next. Well, after pretty soon after they hook the air, the electricity up, it should be up and yeah. running. So they'll be doing a lot of connecting pipes, that outside unit to the inside manifold that's down hanging down in the basement. I like the new voting <clears throat> machine. That's nice. So, so we're going to get the air conditioning up and going and in March. It. Well, heat too. Yeah. Well, I know we're getting towards the end of the season. I'm thinking we're all timing this right, and that's we don't hear about that right. that often. That's pretty yeah. nice. Sure. I wish we'd have that. Most of them, the boiler blue would have been. Well, yeah. I was gonna say, expectation would be on a day like today, the boiler's not gonna be running. Right. Like it would be, and it's what was the temperature, or the threshold? It could go down to zero on the heat pumps. On the heat pumps. Yeah. Then yes. you're exchanging therm for therm. Yeah. Then it gets to an inefficiency point at some point, but he said right, that right. it can get down. He goes, that that's when our boiler kicks in. We'll bring our thermodynamic specialist next right. time to talk about all that, but I'm just curious. I knew there was a point somewhere. Okay. But what? So they started with the health department then, or they're they, still courthouse they are, and then they, next week? They're going to finish the courthouse, and then that same crew is going to go over the health department. That's a really good. Those guys are really good. Yeah. Top notch when we were talking. That's a lot. Day. You can go look at what all they did. There's mm -hmm. a lot of it, uh, engineering that's gone into that. And a lot of, they, I think they've done a great job. So. Have we resolved yeah. the issues with the water softener versus the? Yes, we put a, um, a digital programmable thermostat in there, so it shuts off in the for a couple hours in the night, and that's when the softener regenerates, and then. So we don't have <clears throat> so we don't have those issues anymore. Everything's you've been warm constantly. We right? have not had any issues right. since then. So I mean, thank you. you know, that, yeah. that was kind of a major. That was unfortunate that yeah. that happened before we got <clears throat> that done. So yeah, if we'd have this system up running, it wouldn't have affected anything. Probably wouldn't have anyway. Is there any updates on the jail and all that? They've got the, the new part is all plumbed. Right. Uh, lighting's in. So at, all the lighting all, in the old in the new part is in. Okay. Oh, the new they're still waiting for some fixtures for the old part. Yeah. Okay. And they're due in what next week uh, or the week after? Yeah. I'm trying to think of when he told me that they would be in. I guess <laughs> they they make lighting. They don't make it right. till you order it. So. Um, and so, and then what's the plant painting plan? I when I was up there last week, I said you guys, you're pretty much ready to paint. Then I I think the new part anyway. I said I'd go ahead and call them. And have them come in and you know say hey you know could we paint this maybe by that time i don't know how long it takes them to do it sure maybe by that time they could turn around and paint we need to identify part. those issues we yeah. need to sit down with you think that holds you up at all if they're doing massive painting or the empty has to do some wild logistics as far as booking goes or how would that look like or do you know if they're painting the cells and the hallways and well, all that. Yeah, the, all the new jail portion, is that going to affect As your... far as booking, I wouldn't, I mean, I wouldn't think so. That would be more of a question for Jay. I, I, I mean, hopefully, and I don't know, maybe you know, the booking part would be... That's the only thing to think of. Yeah. Well, A to B, to the booking, where, where I assume he does it in booking. Like, right. I've always done it. Right. And to get from there to without. I think these are on-site questions that we can handle. Okay. Well, you're on. I'm just curious. No, I mean that you can find out. No. Okay. Sounds like more work to me. I still hear mm -hmm. comments about why are we putting money in the old part? You try to explain to people that you, know, you can have so many if you get up to snuff. But same token, I said, I'm not going to vote for the tax. I don't want to put money in the old part. So I think it needs to be explained a little bit better that yeah. it would be 
Yeah. Well, we could get it where we'll pass inspection. We can put prisoners in there. We need to start saving money as soon as we can. Right. Right. Okay. Sure. And we're expending an awful lot of money right now. I agree. When we That's could we have a, a short term versus long term mm -hmm. and get engineers and architects in there to right. figure out what right. we need to do. Regardless, so I, you know, I'm comfortable spending the money on I'm fixing good. up the parts right. of the jail we are now well, because yeah. nothing's yeah. going to happen fast enough. Yeah. Absolute best case. Well, we're yeah, three, three, yeah, yeah we, we still need so, it for a while. That's right. So it's difficult. Well, well and, and no one's saying that we can't, the, the possibility may be that we redo that. Mm -hmm. I mean, that may be the case. We don't know yet. Once we have the money to talk to the experts, then we'll know right. what the right. best way forward is. Take trying to explain to people. It's well, the, you can only do sure. what I you know, can do. I try. Mm -hmm. It's going gonna, it's gonna to cost us more to not do it right. than it will if we do it. explain that so to better. people downtown. Mm -hmm. We've got to. Right. And I, <clears throat> has that been covered yeah. in the paper? I'm trying to recall that particular, do you, do you recall? And I, I know I've read the articles, but I've slept since then, so. I'll be honest, I don't keep that. I mean, I'm a stay-at-home sure, mom, no, I, and I haven't yeah. been following it because I live in Clark County. But not that it's not important to me, so I'm kind of doing catch-up. Um, so I, I can't give you. Okay. I think it has been reasonably well, but, you know, I'm, I'm going to give Gary some credit, too. The, this issue has been so convoluted and different sides and True. different things. Mm -hmm. I think he's done a fair job of covering it, but, I mean, whether that means everybody that reads the articles understands every single nuance of the issue, right. no, probably not. And there's a lot of yeah. wickets there to hit, you know. Yeah, exactly. I have to, just so you'll know, you say you're just trying to catch uh -huh. up. I had some good feedback on your article. Good. They didn't understand the. Nor did I. The headline. Oh, they I don't know what they were yeah, trying to right. do with that headline. Right. I thought maybe we were back in negotiations <laughs> on labor. I didn't even read her headlines, honestly. And I'm going. <laughs> yeah, I had several ear. people. I said, "What does that mean?" And uh, I couldn't Same figure one. it out. So <laughs> it didn't relate to the article. No. So, but it was a good article. Well, thank you. Um, I always try to tell it just as you guys. I mean, what no, unfolds. I use a lot of quotes and whatnot, but I am sure that Gary would love to sit down and try to explain it more in detail because um, I felt like half the people that were at the meeting were, you know, didn't know what was really going on. Mm -hmm. right. Me well, included. then there was misconceptions. Yes, the very sheriff's much so. deputy helped us out a lot yeah. by explaining Clayton. Clayton. I mean, everybody's talking about physical money put in physical facilities, but also there's administration and so forth. Well, we'll get back to that here. Right. Yeah. Yeah. We'll, we'll talk about this right. one in a minute once right. we get probably the, the right. mechanicals right. of the jail. Um, one more thing. <coughs> the the boiler is working fine. Down. Uh, yeah, the jail on the courts. Okay. Um, Old exploding. No, is it's going so on. far so good. Um, I mean... <laughs> The return water from the upstairs is still dumping in the ground. It's not going back to the tank like it should. Mm -hmm. um, and I talked to the guy from Sycamore Engineering quite a bit, and also the guy on site, uh, his name's John Terrell, <coughs> about what they plan to do. That, that one last radiator as you come in the double doors, that's, that's the line that's actually dumping in the ground. What right. he suggests is raising that radiator up coming in on the back side of that wall and putting in those, those tanks are called watchmans the, you know the dump the return water goes in then it then it adds fresh water and then dumps into the boiler so it's tempered but he said put a small watchman behind the wall there um, in that room where oh, he's got all these bowling signs and then put a line it's like a sump pump basically and put a line up and come over and dump into that other watchman instead tank. of going under instead of going under the ground and get so that just get rid of the, the one that's under the ground. Yeah. We just get it off and don't because he goes, you're going to have problems with that continually because the water it sits in that. But if they get that up and pump the water out, it's not going to sit. So the only drawback is we have one more pipe going across the ceiling in the basement someplace, which it's going to run right along. There's right a pipe the there right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, no, I know that's kind of my point. There's. Already so many of them that one more. Uh, it didn't go to and it's a little complicated going through that electrical room. I mean, there's a lot of electrical in that one room, but he says he thinks. He, he also said, I don't know why you got, you know, if you've been there, you've got that little watchman tank and you got the bigger one. He goes, I don't know why you got two. He goes, that doesn't I make sense. And, 
I, he said, I take that old one out. He goes, it's about on its last leg anyway. It looks like it's about ready to rust out anyway. So we take it out. The other one's in good shape. And then he goes, we'll get rid of that. Prior to the meeting in March, we need to, you do, we do, need to sit down with Harvey so we understand where we're at on everything. On bill, I, yeah. <clears throat> I mean, we can't just not pay it and then say, well, we're not paying it until we we need to be proactive on right. that thing. Um, yeah, I agree. <clears throat> yes, you're right. I want to step back one step. Please let me keep me in the loop on uh, putting that thing in my sign room because it's not just my sign room. I have a lot of old vital records in there. Okay. I'll so take just you, keep me I'll in I'll take the you down and show you exactly what... Well, I have pretty good, well, okay. appreciate that. I got a pretty good idea, but I just didn't want them to walk in there someday when, you know, I'm busy or not here and they start, start cutting and... Shoving okay. boxes in the corner. Yeah. They're not boxes, yeah. they're water water everywhere. <laughs> they're cabinets. Right. They're cabinets, and there's some old, old records in there. So okay. I just want to make sure that we, I got plenty of advance notice so I can okay. get those relocated. Now, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll tell John that. Um, and he's pretty good about it. when you tell him, he keeps trying. Like, oh, yeah. He got in, did your voting room before anything, yeah. one of the first things. So yeah. he's real confident. They've been excellent to work with. <clears throat> Absolutely yeah. great to work with. Which is why I wanted them. That he goes, I can get somebody started. He goes, but if you're not in that big a hurry, you'll wait, take them to the health department. And I said, I, I just assume you take those guys over there and do that because they're really good. So, um, well, Janet needs to see something going on. Yeah. And she got her lighting. Done. Yeah, but um, the heating thing's big over there. Yeah, I need to talk to him because before long I'm going to have to kick him out of my election room if he's not already done. But I think they are. Oh, you mean working in there? No, well, downstairs yeah. in my supply room because we're going to start. We're going to start preparing for the election. Laying stuff out. Laying stuff yeah. out and getting. I think by the end of this week they'll be pretty close to being done. With I think all so. of that type of stuff. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> I right. think they'll be pretty much concentrating on. It sounds to me like by the end of this week they'll be pretty much done. Okay. Because I, I know when they start to go into that sign room um i mean i don't know that i don't know where they're going to get involved with now that i'm not i'm not too concerned with other than maintaining <coughs> the records for us um, but the other room is going to is going to be locked down pretty soon okay he and he, he did state to me goes once we get this the refrigeration the system up and going he goes you, you don't have to do that till the summer you don't have to put that line in and do that okay um yeah i kind of thought it was going to be a as spring when you, when you want to do early it. Okay. summer deal uh, yeah it wasn't going to be in the next few weeks okay oh, well good that's good to know yeah once they once they get this new unit system going see the boiler will only boiler. be needed in really 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 Cold. frigid right conditions right. yeah we should be past that pretty well well i hope <coughs> it helps yeah <coughs> Uh, one more thing, just I just remembered, they're measuring the windows where the window unit air conditioners are in. Yeah. So they got a couple different guys, new guys, that are on that as we speak. They've been in measuring. So so that um, I need to talk to them. There's a few windows upstairs. And they do, they you know they know that they do know that. Okay, all right. So they're trying to see if they're going to fit and how they're going to fit and the whole bit. So that for uh, storms and well. Yeah. Uh, yeah, for storm windows. You can't just, but they, well, they made those windows for the I know, conditions. that's what I mean, I'm I, saying. I, I, mean, I hope to somebody be... noticed that when they were quoting that because you've got to take those out right. and put a whole new system in there yeah. and I want them to match. Yeah. Right. So, one more thing, the water treatment for the boilers. Right. He got back with me, I was trying to pull it up, my phone died. Um, I think he said, like, yeah. How to do that? <laughs> <laughs> well, that's my phone. email on your phone. No, it's fine. Borrow. Um, I'm gonna borrow your phone. <laughs> and gave me a quote on what about one to say twelve, sixteen, twelve thousand or something to put that. Uh, to uh, came, came, up with, <coughs> I came up with system in. Holy cow! Yeah. But that's for both, my understanding, the jail and the. Okay. Um, and I want to get 
What's what that? is it? What does it do? It's, 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 it's treating the water. Yeah. So it doesn't cause So it doesn't problems. cause a lot of these problems that we've had. Simply vague. It gets to maintain the interior of the... Uh, it controls the pH uh -huh. of the water. That It's like taking Lipitor. It keeps your pipes from clogging up. Yeah, right. exactly. My pipes are all clogged up. It it actually puts the, the <laughs> water and the steam go through at about sixty two. The water the steam goes through at about sixty mile an hour through the pipes. And he said what this chemical does actually he goes a, a good running system should have a black coating on the inside and it's kind of it's slick. He goes, right now you, you it's you take them apart and it's rusty, kind Friction. of rusty looking. Friction. Because it makes a sciencey word today. Yeah. Yeah. Friction? Yeah. Friction. Sciencey word. Thermes? What'd you say? Yeah. Therms. 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 Yeah. So he said, you know, Thermos physics. If you, you did treat it, you, you, you will do that. It will coat the inside of that system and make it run more efficient. It won't be stealthy. Yeah. Cool. You put some stints so. in it. We're making fun of you now. <laughs> Put some stints on it. <laughs> well, we're not going to be making any decision on that particular issue quite yet. Right. Right? As far as, yeah. I, I want to get with him and, and see if that's something that needs to be expedited due to the fact that we're going to shut that boiler down here pretty soon. Do we need to be running some of that through it before we shut it down? Or, I mean, we've been doing without it for... Can we do it as an additive? Well, it's... Is there something that can maintain the boiler? For example, if you're going to keep fuel for six, eight, ten months, you, put you a, can put a stabilizer yeah. in there. I mean, which that. okay. I mean, it, as opposed to spending six thousand right. dollars per boiler right now, if we can put a gallon of something in there that will stabilize it for the time being, might be helpful. Add, and annually add it right. And now. if the boiler is only going to be being used when it's below zero. I mean, how much is right. it worth for the additional efficiency? If you're going 24/7, sure, you'd probably get your your 16 grain back it, pretty quick. But if you're only running it four days out of the year, you, you might need it more if it's sitting. You know, that, that's, 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 yeah, that could be harder on the oh, side too. Yeah, but it's it. I mean, it, what it is, the pumping system that automatically adds it. I believe once a day. It might be more than once a day, but it might be such a thing that. If you have Mike come in in the morning, he can take and put in a cup or whatever. You dump it into the watchman, <laughs> and it pumps code. through the system in that manner. Oh, so he might be able to let us do this. Circling back, back to the suit. we are going to take a look at that bill and make sure we're we're being upfront okay. and yeah, dealing with it so we don't. You know, Harvey's helped us over the years. We certainly do not want to do something without some discussions and he may have some information from the insurance company, etc. Right. I mean we don't want to get we've always paid our bills and Well I was a little I saw the bill and I was a little I guess I thought the bill should have been more had more explanation in it than what it is. Well, just it just boom, fix the boiler four thousand dollars, nothing in there four say, times. Which time did yeah. is this cover <laughs> anyway. Right. So mm -hmm. any other questions? Mr. Patrick. Okay. Nothing. Danny? Nothing? No cat stories? No, I, I, you're probably tired of hearing cat stories. Aren't you? No. No, you're always. It kind of breaks things <laughs> up. Start feeding them every day. Rattle the fence, and they come out and eat. And you send five bottle lambs over to your place for you to feed with yeah, the yeah. cats? <laughs> Down the floor now. So. Was that Chucky that was asking you about that? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So that's all. Yeah, I could ask about it. Yeah, I scattered around the neighborhood and nobody's complained about it. So. Yeah. I have nothing. Carl? Nothing. Nope. Nothing. I have one question for Derek. Is this you always said you that that that. You always said nothing. Well, you said nothing. No, it's, and he's the guy we pick on. It's no, an no, airport no. question. Okay. Oh, yeah. well, um, how are the hang releases arranged to does the nay and yay and all of that stuff is that there's really the not board? anything in place as far as you know if someone knew it, let's say we had an open tea hanger mm -hmm. like there's not a really a vetting process there's rules as far as what you can have and not mm -hmm. have as far as people that we may want to evict if they you know continue with behaviors then that would be something that we would basically decide as a county board and pass to the airport today Okay, that, that's why I was wondering. I was talking to somebody on the advisory committee, and they were just 
Hmm. I didn't know. Yeah. Hmm. What are they talking about? Yeah, I can't tell you. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, just curious where the ultimate buck lay on that one. Yeah. Tom handles it basically at this point. That's a good answer. Yeah. And if we need to step in and, and if help Tom's him. not comfortable handling it, he passes it on to us. That's fine. Yeah. There you go. Okay. That's right. Um, of course, you know we had the uh, special meeting last Monday night at 5 p. Uh, 5 Thursday night. Was it Thursday night? Yeah. Last Thursday. Thursday. Jeez, that's right. Right up to top of things here. Last Thursday night, uh, we had a modest turnout, as was described in the paper. We had several people that came in and were negative to it, and before they left, they told us that they were now in favor of it. Uh, my question to you is, should we go ahead with the plan to have the next one a week from Monday tonight at 7 p.m., same time, same, or same place does anybody well, okay that's next monday now that would be next monday at March seven. March yes March it's March. been advertised i think we kind of need to stick with it just as an eye i i do too but i'm only one at well, seven later in the evening may have two yeah right. Right. that's why we did later. one at five right. and then well, one I think, at seven I think it went well, right. yeah and i don't know if the turnout what it well, would be but i'd really hate for one person to show up and say hey i heard it was going to be here and Right. Find I a locked that. door. That's and I, I think everybody contributed on the board, and it was it was a it was a good evening, and we got some direction, and there were good questions and discussions, and there nothing got out of hand. Mm -hmm. It was it was good. Yeah. So, well, Augie, if you would, you, he has the paperwork to go ahead and set that up. Uh, Gary will be back by then. Yeah. Not that we're not having Maybe. Are you kicking me out already? Yeah. <laughs> so I, that was the main thing that we had to uh, make sure that everybody was on board with that. There wasn't some different idea about how we should handle it, but I think that's good. Uh, we don't have a... Does anybody need a uh, closed session for anything? Yes. Uh, on litigation, there's rumors going around about... Stop. Okay. Okay. It's rumors. Okay. Then, hmm. if you want to go into exact session, like to, yes. okay, that's fine. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to that's be fine. disrespectful. I'm used to it. 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 Hearing no, no more you know, years. regular I I guess I discussions. Sure. By the way, before we go in, we always let Gary or whoever's here know that no action will be taken during this closed session, and no action will be taken afterwards. Okay. Okay. So free then. Yes. Okay. So you but I, I like to say that. Okay. okay. Thank you. So much. And did Gary forget to tell you that we had him in charge of bringing donuts right. every night? Right. Did forget did. that. Like <laughs> like like work. Work. Oh my you know, <clears throat> the griddles or something. Anyway, uh, I entertain. What's what's less less healthy than a donut? I know. <laughs> a griddle. Uh, Dan made a motion. Do you make a motion to go to exec session for litigation? litigation. Second. I'll second. I get. It. I'll bring on. Phil. Phil gets. It. Okay. Because. And then we may have a report later on the cruise, but you know. <laughs> All those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed, nay. Thank you. Well, go into okay. Uh, is there anything else to come before the study session this morning? Hearing none. Motion to adjourn. It's a move. Derek moves. Andy seconds. All those in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed, nay. Uh, he's